going on guys? It's your boy 100 Gang Nate and today I am at Maserati of Atlanta and I ran into something very special. But before we get into that, if you need a hoodie, it's cold outside, go ahead and get one at 100gangclothing.com. I really appreciate it. It helps the channel. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. If you're old to the channel, I love you for always supporting me. Thank you. But today we have the brand new 2022 Audi R8. And in my opinion, this vehicle right here is the most underrated hypercar that's on the market in today's time. I don't know why it's so overlooked, but in my opinion, it is everything that other supercars are. It's just not as promoted, I guess. So let's get in and I'm gonna show you some of the features of this brand new 2022 Audi R8. Let's go. First, when it comes to supercars slash hypercars, you want to have a great appearance. You want to have a vehicle that says, whoa, what's that? You want to turn the head, you know? This is what we're in here for. We're in here not to be regular, but to be very different. In my opinion, this strikes you, especially with the color, the design. I feel like when you see this on the road, the first thing you may ask yourself is, what is this? What is that? You know, it's a V10, top speed of 205 miles per hour. Gets you to 0 60 in 3.4 seconds. I mean, it's just a beautiful vehicle. It's wrapped in carbon. We got carbon right here, carbon right here, carbon on the dash inside, we'll get in there. Got carbon on the side view mirrors. The grill is aggressive. I really like it. The LED lights on point, you know I love the LEDs. And the color just pops. It's just, it stands out on its own. If you see this car, you're gonna question it. Just from the color alone, it's gonna call attention. But I just love the fine details of the vehicle. We got the spoiler back here. This is carbon as well. Get to the V10 engine. Look, got the glass so you can see it. And better, more than that, we have these pipes back here. Rear diffuser is carbon. And look how massive these pipes are. I just want you guys to see. I'm gonna get down here. And this is my fist. It can fit inside the exhaust. That's insane. Like, the Audi R8, in my opinion, should be one of those cars that's talked about with Lamborghini and Ferrari, you know, in my opinion. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Let's get inside and check it out even more. So when it comes to getting into these supercars, like hypercars, these are no easy feats because they sit so low to the ground. But I'm gonna get in and I'm gonna show you how we go in and look. We got carbon fiber already standing outside. We got carbon fiber on the air vents and that's just already beautiful to me. And we're gonna step in, look at their interior, wrapped in leather. Look at the seats. Got like a, I don't know, a diamond design on the seats. Very beautiful leather. Let's step in, let's get a closer look. So as soon as you step in, you see we gotta look at the dash. The dash has carbon already wrapped around it. Got the steering wheel, nice leather feel. Let you know right here, you're in the Audi R8. Right. Start to push, I mean push button start. Drive select modes. And um, right here we got the AC, um, that's what else we got right here. Look like we have some ashtray space, everything else, you know, gear selector. It's like a pad selector here. In my opinion, I can say right here, this is probably where the Audi falls a little bit short. It's like, it really doesn't have much entertainment when you get in here. It's kind of straight to the point, you know, you get in here and you're here to drive. This is the cockpit. It's not much going on. You know, like in the Lamborghini and Ferraris, I think it's a little bit more going on. Not so much Ferrari, but Lamborghini. I'll say a little bit more is going on. But like I said before, this car right here, it's, it goes 205 miles an hour, zero to 60, 3.4 seconds. And it's about $200,000. When you're getting a Lamborghini Ferrari, you're gonna pay at least 400,000, 380. You know what I'm saying? This is the same type of car basically for half the price. I mean, it's an Audi, give or take, but in my opinion, this is still a supercar. In my personal opinion, the 2022 Audi R8 is a beast. It is a straight beast mode, but what it does fall short in is the entertainment inside. The radio, you don't have a physical radio. You have the radio from the dashboard and it's an Audi at the end of the day. So that's why I feel like it may not get as much praise as Lamborghini and like Ferrari, but in terms of performance, it's right up there with it. Like I said before, 205 miles per hour top speed, 3.4 seconds, zero to 60. And the color stands out. 
And if you just want another exclusive vehicle to add to your garage, you can come down here to Maserati of Atlanta and I'll make it happen for you, in my opinion. For the price, performance, it's right up there with it. It's just one of those things that is just overlooked. Like I said, maybe it may be because it's an Audi, but at the end of the day, this car, the Audi, the 2022 Audi R8 V10 can hold its own. Thank you for watching, subscribing, all of that. It never goes unnoticed. I love you guys. See you next video. And you know it's cold outside, so get yourself a hoodie at 100gangclothing.com. See you next time. Let's go.